In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can find the transpose of a matrix using a Casio ClassWiz calculator. And for this video, we'll do a really simple worked example. So we've got a three by three matrix, which is simply the matrix one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nice and easy to remember. So we're going to start by putting this calculator into the correct mode. So to do that, we need to press menu and we want to find the one that looks a bit like a matrix. So that's here on option four. So you press that, we're now asked to define the matrix. So we're going to use matrix A by convention. So we're going to select option one. It will then ask for the dimensions of matrix A. And you can see that it's a three by three matrix. So we've got number of rows is going to be three. Then the number of columns is going to be three as well. And then it will ask us to enter our data. So you just press the number and then equals then the number and then equals and just keep going and it'll automatically move to the next element. If you want, you can use the arrow keys to navigate around the matrix and make any corrections that you need to. Once you've completely filled in the matrix, you simply press the button AC and that's now in the calculator's memory. The next step is we want this screen here to have TRN and then in brackets, we want uh, matrix A. And to do that, we're going to use this option button. So we press option, then go down, and we've got transposition. So we press three, and that's accessing the correct function. Then we want to recall the matrix from the calculator's memory. So we press option again. Then we want to press three for matrix A. Then close the brackets, and then press equals. And you now have the transpose of the matrix, and we've now solved the problem. So I hope this was helpful to you. If it was, please like and subscribe below for more calculator tutorials. And finally, thank you very much for watching.